I have something very important to say, and if you're under 30, under 35, it can change your life. Stretching. Stretching. This is something that I did when I was young. If you play a sport, you stretch. You might even have stretching both before and after your practice, before or, or after the game, or both. Um, Stretching is really important, and somewhere in my 20s I got arrogant and stopped stretching. I don't know why that happened. So even thinking about it makes me want to do that, because here's what happens. Okay, this is the news. It's, it's bad news, people under 35, under 30. As you age, your body goes like this. This is why old people often have distended stomachs. The spine gets smaller, and it does this, and the organs don't have anywhere to go. Sorry, that's how it goes. When you need stretching is right about the time you're deciding not to do it. When you're like 30 or 35, because it's that excellent feeling of having made it through your teens, made it through your 20s, and ah, I, I've pretty much done a lot of this stuff, and now I'm just doing it another time, and I, ah, I've got, I've got this down, I've got this down. Don't give up the stretching. That's like giving up doing a draft of something. That's like giving up a rehearsal. That's like giving up all kinds of things. Stretch, stretch. It's really good. You can do it really swiftly. The other thing that happens is that people get into yoga and they want a really big stretch. It's got to be the biggest stretch ever in the world. It doesn't have to be that. Just do a little bit of stretching. I know someone in his late 70s, every day, 10 sit-ups, 10 push-ups, just like that. That's another way of doing it too. Just get your body active, keep it active, just like that.